was shortly before the state board announced that Monty Guthrie would take over as the superintendent for Western Heights. Western Heights came back and said they were going to announce their own superintendent during a meeting tomorrow. It's a move that Joy Hoffmeister says is inappropriate. Inappropriate and continued disregard for the authority of the State Board of Education. State Superintendent Joy Hoffmeister says the time for Western Heights to make a decision on a new superintendent to replace Mannix Barnes should have happened prior to the end of their July 8th probationary period. Just an inappropriate step and would not be valid any decisions that are made um, in that meeting and certainly not recognized. Uh, they don't possess that authority right now after that decision by the state board to move for state intervention. Monty Guthrie with 26 years of education experience, including overseeing school accreditations for the state board of ed, will now act as the interim super, the liaison between Western Heights and the state during their one year intervention period. He has watched and worked through these last months of seeing the community um, desperate for uh, new change and um, he's really eager to get started and work together with everyone at Western Heights. This comes a month after the board suspended Barnes's superintendent certificate and after the district's repeated failure to correct a laundry list of complaints, including mishandling funds to poor performance to a reduction in staff and learning loss. We are disgusted in what has transpired in the two short years. Hoffmeister is confident now Western Heights is on the right track. Monty Guthrie is hyper focused on doing what is best for kids and helping um, really unite the community. Now, Western Heights is meeting will take place tomorrow afternoon. We'll let you know what happens there. Reporting live tonight, Katrina Adger, KOCO 5 News.